Criminal Minds eliminated two of Spencer Reed's prospective love interests, one of which may have developed into the show's greatest romance. Reed, portrayed by Matthew Gray Gubler, and J.J. were the only two characters from the original series to appear in each of the show's seven seasons. Known as the FBI's golden boy of the behavioral analysis unit Bao, Reed played a crucial role in nearly every case the profilers worked on. Criminal Minds committed time to his personal life in addition to becoming a member of the team. Gubbler was not only a member of the original cast, but also an obvious favorite of the audience. Thanks to his brilliance and distinctive quirks, it was fascinating to watch him collaborate with the other members of the bow. But Reed's own storyline was equally interesting. It was difficult not to support him after he overcame several setbacks, such as the passing of his mentor, a period of incarceration, and the declining health of his mother. So, there was hope that he would get the love he deserved every time Criminal Minds introduced a love interest. Criminal Minds made several attempts to pair Reed up romantically throughout the years. Sadly, nobody truly remained by his side the way Savannah Hayes and Will LaMontani did for J.J. and Derek Morgan. Every now and again, Reed would get into a fascinating relationship with a new individual, but the show would never go further with it. Out of all the people the character could fall in love with, Leela Archer, played by Amber Heard and bartender Austin, are the two that stick out. In Someone's Watching, the 18th episode of Criminal Minds Season 1, Reed first meets Leela. The SSA was designated as her guardian after her manager was killed. There was a lively interaction between the two, with Leela obviously trying to flirt with Reed. Reed eventually gave in and began talking to her. Criminal Minds hinted that the couple would keep dating once her case was settled. The show simply hinted that they eventually broke up, but it never depicted how their relationship developed after that one outing. Later, in 52 Pickup, an episode of Criminal Minds Season 4, Reed and Austin got to know one another. The two had met in a bar, so their introduction was much more natural. Reed tried charmingly hitting on Austin, a bartender, as part of Morgan's attempt to educate him how to woo ladies. They ended up dating since they had such wonderful chemistry. Unfortunately, Criminal Minds chose to cancel its arc as well after a few episodes. Reed and Maeve Donovan eventually developed a close relationship that ended in a tragic accident. Nevertheless, it's hard to avoid being upset that Reed and Austin's romance didn't get more attention when considering all of the love partners the SSA had in the first season of Criminal Minds. The two got along well and truly liked each other's company. In Austin, Reed also exuded a noticeable sense of ease and carelessness. There was no reason to separate them. Had things continued a bit longer, perhaps Reed would have eventually ended up with her. There was dismay that Matthew Gray Gubbler, who played Reed in the hit show's final season, was not among the returning cast members. There were scheduling issues, which is the simplest explanation for his absence. Gubbler commented about the show, saying, They did a newer spin-off of the show, but it was filming while I was filming something else. But I'm eager. Maybe everything will work out soon. That Gubbler's refusal to come back had nothing to do with Reed's non-appearance was fantastic news. He stated that he would love to return to the program and that he is still friendly with the cast. But that needs to happen which means the creators need to figure out why they should bring Reed back into the fold after he was absent for the entire previous season. That ought to be simple. Oh. The band made sure fans didn't forget about Reed by bringing up the subject and discussing him throughout the first season. A lot of fans would be thrilled to see Reed rejoin the team for season two, which is quickly approaching. Better yet, he should return as a regular cast member. His eccentric demeanor and nature were missed in the first season of Criminal Minds, Evolution. Fans ought to use caution when making wishes, though. There was a lot of speculation that Reed might come back as the next unsub, which would be detrimental to all the characters stood for during his tenure on the program.